Hello, today we will try to create a program that prints its source code to console. It is also called self-repeating program or Quine. But is it really possible to do it? Let's find it out. We will use Java for this project. First let's try with naive approach. Basically, let's read the file content and print it to console line by line. Let's speed up the video here a bit. Here we will be using built-in Java features. Basically chaining buffered reader, input stream reader and file input stream. Okay, that works. But it's not considered as pure quine as we are working with a source code as a file. In some sense it's a cheating. Okay, let's try to find another approach. We will split our program into two parts, actual code and the string that will contain exactly our program with all class and method definitions. We will use system out printf to output the string and interpolate it with our program as string. We already got the result, but it does not match 100%. We need to deal with quotes somehow. Let's try to do it an easy way. No, it does not work. Actually, we can do a trick and use character 34 as replacement for quotes. Now it looks better. I will just remove all extra spaces and line breaks from the code to make it a bit ugly. Now we can compare our original and printed code. They look the same. As you might imagine Java is a very verbose language and we spend a lot on class and method definition. Let's see how it can be done with JavaScript. Again we can start with a cheating version. Basically we can print the function itself. Sorry, this way. Now you can imagine what we will do next. Okay, with a one-liner we can get a quine. But let's do a proper quine now. Defining a variable s that will contain our program and we will use console log to print it with interpolation. Same as with Java we need to deal with quotes. Luckily there is a percent %j operator that outputs the parameter as json value. For strings it will be encoded into double quotes. This is a proper quine. And it concludes our video. Hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching.